This final part of the course combines, confirms and reinforces all of the key elements that have been covered over the previous sections. Developing and implementing situation awareness is a skill. At first it might seem awkward and you may feel a little self-conscious, but with practice it will become instinctive. By learning to monitor the baseline, you will start to pick up on those variations and changes that may represent a risk to yourself, your family or your organisation. However, it's equally important to actively avoid normalcy bias and focus lock. We've already articulated how those two factors can act as barriers to effective situation awareness and it's really important that both are managed and eliminated. Finally, it's essential to adopt alertness levels that are appropriate to the environment and baseline that's been visited or worked within. So move on to the next page of this section to start pulling things together.